Um, so to graph this one, we need to just, I'm just going to write the equation of a circle in standard form there. So hopefully this will help us in uh, manipulating this equation that they've given us to be in that standard form. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to move all my x's closer together. So I have an x squared minus 2x. And then the y's as well. I'm going to have a y squared plus 6y. And all of this is going to equal 6. Now I just need to complete the square for both the x and the y. And whatever I do to one side, I've got to do to the other side of the equal sign. So on this one, it looks like I would be adding 1. And I am skipping some steps on this for, right for completing the square. 1 is half of the b value, which is squared. So that really would have been a negative 1 squared on that. If I cut that 6 in half, that'd be 3, and if I square that, I'd have a 9 there. But remember, just don't forget this other side, all right? That's one of the main things on these that people gen generally forget, is to add this to both sides of the equation. So now, I can change these into perfect squares. This would be x minus 1 squared. And then I'm adding this to my y values. That's a y plus 3 squared. And this would equal 6 plus 1 plus 9, 16. That's pretty nifty because the radius is the square root of that 16. And that tells us the radius is 4. And in addition to that, we can find the center being the values h and k. So that would be 1 and negative 3. And I did skip more steps on this one. So let's graph the center at 1, negative 3, would be right here. And then we need to go four points in both direction, four units in both direction, all directions, which would just kind of tell me where the circle should land on this thing. One, whoa, oh, yeah, that's fine. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's not a great graph, but hopefully this one will turn out. And there we go. There's our circle. We found the radius, which is this point. I'm sorry, that's the center, rather. And we did find the radius as well. And we got our graph.